Well, homes in Silver Park vandalized with Nazi graffiti and hate speech early Sunday morning, and now the search for the people responsible continues. Peyton Kennedy is live at Metro Police West Precinct with how residents can, or how they are stepping in to help clean up, and some of that ring doorbell camera footage. Yeah, Neil, thanks to that ring surveillance video from a Sylvan Park resident, Metro Police are able to say that at least two people were involved in this vandalism. This video that you're seeing, it comes from one of the impacted homes just before 1.30 a.m. on Sunday, and it shows what appears to be two men with their faces covered, one who sprayed the ring camera. Metro Police say hate messages were left on five homes along West Long Drive, Nebraska Avenue, Wyoming Avenue, Colorado Avenue, and Idaho Avenue. Anyone who lives in the area is asked to check their home surveillance systems for videos or photos of the suspects. Officers say there is an increased patrol presence in the neighborhood and around the city's Jewish institutions. Sunday afternoon, dozens came together with power washers and spray paint remover to start the cleanup process. Children made poster boards with messages of inclusion. And the residents say they feel called to speak publicly against hate speech in their neighborhood. We deeply grieve that anyone would attempt to intrude on this community spewing toxic, hateful, polarizing messages. At the end of the day, this is our community, and we love each other so much, and that's the message that we have today, one of love. In addition to the surveillance video, if you have any further information, you are asked to call Crime Stoppers. Reporting in Nashville, Peyton Kennedy, News 2. All right.